Shortly after our marriage, we realized we wanted a life of freedom, a life of travel and adventure. We've camped at some of the country's most pristine campgrounds and explored the best attractions and excursions across the USA. Now we're going to share our favorite spots with you. Each episode, we'll be staying a night in a new RV and we'll be sharing some of our favorite features with you. We're going to introduce you to some of our favorite campgrounds and take you to some of America's best travel destinations. I'm Dan. And I'm Lindsay. And you're watching The, the Happy, Happy Camper, Camper Bucket, Bucket List. This week, we are in the charming southern city of Savannah, Georgia. Over 13 million visitors were recorded visiting here just last year alone. The downtown area is one of the largest national historic landmark districts in the United States, making it an obvious attraction for history buffs across the country. The rich history, striking architecture, delicious cuisine, and natural beauty is why we added Savannah, Georgia to our bucket list. Just minutes from downtown Savannah is the state historic site of Wormslow, otherwise known as the Wormslow Plantation. The 822 acre property protects part of what was once the Wormslow Plantation. The estate is the oldest standing structure in all of Savannah. You can enjoy the breathtaking live oaks and Spanish moss. Explore the ruins of Jones' fortified house. And experience living history by watching an authentic demonstration of colonial life. Include this one-of-a-kind plantation in Savannah, Georgia on your bucket list. The city of Savannah was originally laid out around four open squares, each with four residential blocks and four civic blocks. Today there are 24 squares with memorials, plaques, and monuments, all telling the story of Savannah's rich history. We're here at Johnson Square today because it was the first of all the squares and is the largest still to this day. Now that we've seen this beautiful city from the outside, let's go explore the inside of one of Savannah's most well-known mansions, the Owens Thomas House and Slave Quarters. We're here with Shannon, the curator of this spectacular home. So what is your favorite artifact here in the house? Actually, my favorite artifact is not in the house. It's behind the house. So in the slave quarters, paint blue paint was painted on the ceiling by the first slaves that lived there. So it's a mixture of buttermilk, lime, and indigo, and it's a West African tradition. Uh, they had a belief that spirits couldn't cross water. So they paint this blue color on windows and door frames, on the ceiling, and it's really as close as we get to their own thoughts and beliefs because they couldn't read Just 18 miles from Savannah lies Tybee Island. It's known for its wide sandy beaches and its many outdoor activities making it an obvious choice for campers looking to explore Savannah. We love camping at Rivers Inn Campground here in Tybee Island because it's close enough to Savannah to be a short drive, but far enough away that you still feel secluded in nature and away from the hustle and bustle. Today we had some rain in Savannah and it was the perfect reminder why we love RV vacations the best. We're hiding out in the RV because it's pouring down rain and it has been for couple hours yeah now. but this is one of the nice things about RVing and being able to take your home with you when you go on vacation this trip we're staying in a Coleman Lantern travel trailer this 24 foot camper sleeps four making it the perfect camper to get you started in the RV world I love that it's cozy but still has a queen-size bed and the couch converts to a bed for guests it's got an awesome AC and it's lightweight making it perfect for towing with an SUV There's no better way to see this unique city than from the Savannah River Boat Cruises. Drift along the Savannah River. Hear the cannon being fired from Old Fort Jackson and view the incredible nature of beautiful Georgia. 
Getting to see the city from the river was really a great time. And now that we're off the boat and we're right down here on River Street, we can't wait to just go explore all the shops, the restaurants, and just kind of take in the sights. Thank you so much for joining us in beautiful, historic Savannah, Georgia. We're crossing Savannah off of our bucket list and we'll see you next time on the Happy Camper Bucket List.